Definitions for sine, cosine, and tangent. So here's the summary. Sine is opposite over hypotenuse, cosine is adjacent over hypotenuse, and tangent is opposite over adjacent. So let's see what we mean by that. First, we're going to define opposite, adjacent, and hypotenuse. If we have a right triangle and we label one of the angles theta, then opposite is the side that is farthest from that angle. Adjacent is the remaining leg of the right triangle, and hypotenuse is the longest side of the right triangle. So at this point, we note that all right triangles with an angle in common are similar. So here we have two triangles. They're different sizes, but we assume that both of them have the same angle theta for one of their angles. So they're similar because the third angle has to be 90 minus theta because the sum of the angles in the triangle has to be 180 degrees. So all right triangles with an angle in common are similar. And because they're similar, that means that their sides have to be in fixed ratio. So the ratios of the size of these triangles can be determined simply as a function of theta. So for example, let's consider uh, the following triangle with an angle uh, theta of 45 degrees. The ratio of the opposite to the adjacent is always 1. So no matter what size this triangle is, no matter how you rotate this triangle or move it around, the, the, if this angle, if it's a right triangle and has this angle theta of 45 degrees, the opposite to the adjacent, that ratio, will always be 1. So now we come to our definitions of sine, cosine, and tangent. So because these ratios are fixed given theta, uh, we can define sine of theta as the ratio of the opposite to the hypotenuse in that right triangle. Cosine is similarly defined as the ratio of the adjacent to the hypotenuse. And finally, tangent of theta is the ratio of the opposite to the adjacent. Now there's a mnemonic for this, for sine, cosine, and tangent, called SOHCAHTOA. So sine is opposite over hypotenuse, S-O-H. Cosine is the adjacent over the hypotenuse. And the tangent is the opposite over the adjacent. So another little quick thing here is that the tangent of theta is actually, can be related to the other two as sine over cosine. So the sine of theta is the opposite over hypotenuse. Cosine is adjacent over hypotenuse. And Notice if we take the sine and divide it by the cosine, it's opposite over hypotenuse over adjacent over hypotenuse. The hypotenuse terms cancel. We're left with opposite over adjacent, which is the definition for tangent of theta. So we've shown here that the tangent of theta is also equal to the sine over the cosine. And three more quick definitions here. Secant is defined as 1 over the cosine. Cosecant is 1 over the sine. And cotangent is 1 over the tan.